Good morning, everyone. George Knott here from Galgopod, and today I'm happy to announce our second fundraiser. It takes a global village. We will be featuring three U.S. rescue organizations, and they will be Love, Hope, Believe, Galgo, Grateful Greyhounds, and Galgo del Sol. So let's meet our three dogs. Our first dog is Travis. He's a black male Galgo. He was born in February 2018. He weighs approximately 27 kilograms, was rescued by FBM on February 3rd, 2020. He is described as very affectionate, playful, and caring. He is a special needs dog in that his front legs tend to extend. Um, however, this has been looked at and a scan has been done and there's nothing specifically wrong with him and he manages to get around just fine and he does like to sprint uh, in a fenced field. Our second dog is May. He's a male Galgo, six years old. He's described as calm, sweet, a friendly dog, loves people and gets along with other dogs at the shelter. He was rescued by Galgo's Infamilia and according to them, um, they said had they not taken him, uh, the hunter had promised to get rid of him in his own way. Hmm. So thankfully, they stepped in and rescued him. Uh, he does have a big scar on his right shoulder that is still healing. But other than that, he should be ready for adoption once he comes over. Our third galgo is Wally. Wally is described as a shy boy and still a bit nervous. He has been at Galgo del Sol since March of 2018, and he was rescued along with five others from, uh, actually, they were all at the vet and going to be put to sleep. Galgo del Sol got word and took all six. He's the only one that remains. He does have a place to go once he arrives in the U.S. He'll be fostered, and then he, once he gains his confidence, he will be ready for his forever home here in the U.S. So those are our three dogs. I really am hoping that we have as much success with this fundraiser as we did the last one. As you know, the last one we raised over $6,000. We have, which helped bring over four dogs. There's a fifth one coming, uh, I think, in the next couple of weeks. So that was really a success. And I know it hasn't been that long since we did the fundraiser, but, you know, the, the shelters are overflowing over there in Spain with dogs. They've got them in private residency because the shelters are full. The EU ban that continues for Americans has made it so difficult and expensive for the dogs to come over that um, currently, you know, we just have to raise a lot more money for each dog. And, um, you know, it's just been wonderful because everybody's been so good about it. So, folks, if you can help out, that would be great. Love to see these three dogs come over. And thank you very much. Have a good day.